The unveiling came against the backdrop of the California night sky. The new B-21 bomber looks a bit like a stingray with sleek bat-like wings, but it's designed not to be seen. It incorporates half a century of advances in stealth technology capable of precision nuclear or conventional strikes anywhere in the world. Defense Secretary Lloyd Austin on hand for the big reveal at an Air Force site near Los Angeles. Even the most sophisticated air defense systems will struggle to detect a B-21 in the sky. It's the first new American bomber in more than 30 years as the Pentagon works to modernize all three legs of the U.S. nuclear triad, the ability to launch a nuclear strike from land, sea, or air. Northrop Grumman touting the B-21's long-range and advanced computing power, calling it a digital bomber. The world has never seen technology like the B-21. The bomber was unveiled under cover of darkness in a closely controlled event, giving the public a glimpse without revealing highly classified secrets, which the Pentagon hopes will give the U.S. an edge in its growing military rivalry with China. As the Defense Department warns, Beijing is rapidly expanding its own nuclear arsenal. Six of the new bombers are currently in production, but the military has said it plans to order at least 100 in all. The first test flight is expected next year. The B-21 Raider, named after the Doolittle Raiders from World War II, whose surprise attack on Japan after Pearl Harbor helped restore America's military morale. This isn't just another airplane. It's the embodiment of America's determination, and it's a testament to our strategy of deterrence with the capabilities to back it up. And Josh Letterman joins us now from the White House. Josh, what do these bombers cost? Well, the Air Force has estimated each one would cost $692 million, but inflation is clearly going to affect those costs. And so the final price per plane is likely to be well over $700 million. Jose? Thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Follow today's top stories and breaking news by downloading the NBC News app.